A few of the other measures are the clean energy supplement will no longer be indexed. That, uh, this is starting from the 1st of July. The National Partnership Agreement. Uh, now this I think uh, relates to the concessions relating to the Commonwealth Health Card as well, where some of these utility bills that you get discounts on may not be discounted. So just something to be aware of if you're planning your, your, you know, your expenses throughout the year. Uh, just factor that in as well. Another couple of offsets being pegged back over the last few budgets is the dependent spouse tax offset. Now they reduced it for those people that were under a certain age limit, but now they're reducing it altogether. So if you had a non-working spouse then and that was dependent on you, you got this 2,470, potentially up to that amount, $2,471 of tax back because you were supporting another person. They're going to abolish that altogether regardless of your age. There's also a mature age worker tax offset of $500 which was used to encourage mature age workers. I think they called mature those over 55 years of age. They're going to get rid of that as well. So you'll have $500 less in your pocket if you're working and over age 55. And there's a biannual indexation of the fuel excise that I'm sure that you've all heard about. So. Uh, they're going to start to in, uh, index up that excise that was, was frozen a number of years ago. And that's from the 1st of July 2014.